to my journal and just slide that here. Today I'll be talking about one of my secrets to success for anatomy. And it won't be a secret anymore because I'm sharing it with you guys. Anyway, so I already talked about this resource in my previous video. Um, this video is called How to Crush Anatomy towards the end of the video, Anatomy. And you can go ahead and watch it because it will help you because there's other resources as well. But you don't need to use other resources as this resource that I'm about to tell you is more than enough. Also, um, I want to make this video just on its own about this resource because I think it's just amazing. I'm actually going to spell it out to you. K-E-N-H-U-B. Can help. Can help is just a phenomenal platform. It it doesn't only contain anatomy, it has histology and radiology. I'm in third year now and I started doing radiology now and I just use Can help for radiology. It has all the x-rays and all the explanation, everything that I need inside here, and it's just amazing for me. Also, in first year I was doing histology and histology was kind of hard for me because under the microscope most of the cells looked so familiar. Um, most of the cells looked so similar so I was like I was like what is this cell what's that cell so when I came across Kenhub I was just so lucky because it was so much easier for me to have all the slides with their explanation in one platform so like Kenhub is my go-to-go -go for everything you know so um, in first year I was doing histology and histology was kind of hard for me because under the microscope most of the cells looked so similar so I was like I was like what is this cell what's that cell so when I came across Kenhub I was just so lucky because it was so much easier for me to have all the slides with their explanation in one platform so like Kenhub is my go-to-go -go for everything you know so um, not only that, Kenhub is amazing because when you have Kenhub, you don't need to worry about buying textbooks. You need to worry about, oh, I don't know if I have enough information or not because Kenhub gives you the right amount of information and the information that you need for your exams right at your fingertips. Also, the way the information is presented in Kenhub is really important because you're going to be learning information and when you learn information, it should be presented in a way that you're able to learn easily and recall the information during the exams you don't have information and information upon information then when the exam comes everything is just muddled up so it can help it specializes the information in a way that it's easier to memorize that's very important and recall during the exam that was really helpful for me because i was able to use that information and learn effectively and then recalling the exam when i was doing the exam and i was able to get the grade that i wanted I want to help you guys to get the grades that you deserve. So I'm going to show you guys how I use Kenhub and hopefully you will get a bird's eye view into the website. And there's a good news towards the end of the video. So, so stay tuned and continue watching. The surprise is towards the end. You won't regret it. <laughs> First of all, you can look here. There's anatomy, histology and radiology anatomy. The one I was, the three subjects I was talking about. Um, this is anatomy. We're going to look through how anatomy is presented. The an anatomy is presented um, here. So I'm going to click on the upper limb. This is the overview. So the way the information is presented, it's amazing. For example, you have the upper limb. The upper limb, talking about the regions, the bones, the muscles, the veins, and the nerves for each and every part. So everything is divided. The hand, the forearm, the arm, and the shoulder. So... It goes in sections and then you can learn in sections like you can go through all the bones first and then go through the muscles of the upper limb and then the nerves and the, you know, the arteries, etc. Let's click on the main bones of the upper limb. So I clicked on it. For every section you pick, when you open the section, you're going to have a video and you're going to be allowed to take a quiz. I usually use my quizzes after when i'm coming back to recall information for example i will watch the video today i'll learn the information tomorrow i'll come back and do the quiz and it will help me realize what information i know and what information i don't and the can help quizzes are absolutely amazing because it highlights the names or the sections of the bone or muscles or any region that you don't know proper customized quizzes so you can have a level of difficulty easy hard or you know even harder or mixture etc so this is the customized quizzes and this is the thing i was talking about the diagram the atlas so you don't even need to buy sabata atlas you don't need to buy um gray's anatomy you have this this has all the names that too in latin if you're learning it in latin you know and look all of them are here 
and I have information explanation here. So all of these bones of the hand, the arm, the hand is here. And if you don't know how to pronounce some Latin words because they can get harder, you could just have to press this. Humerus. Humerus. So you know that's a humerus bone. And it has the back, the posterior side. And this is what you need to know, the summary. The summary is absolutely amazing. For example, here it talks about the way the information is presented in the whole arm, all the bones. So in the upper region, you have the clavicula, you have the scapula, and you have the humerus, the upper joint. And then in the lower area, the, uh, you have the radius and the ulna, and then you have the manus, and you have the articulation means the joints. So it gives you all the joints that are in the upper limb, and bones related to each region of the arm. And I call this the table quiz or like the cheat sheet and you need these, especially when you're learning anatomy because the way the information is organized. If you're doing muscles, it's really helpful because it will give you the origin, the insertion, the innervation and the arteries. And this is very useful because then you're not looking elsewhere. Oh, what was the origin? What was the insertion? Everything will be just presented to you in that beautiful table. Tell you what you should do afterwards. You say continue your learning. You can click on that. You let's explore the bone and the way the video is presented is absolutely beautiful let's click on the video if there is one thing that creates drama in an action movie or a hit tv medical series is someone with a dislocated shoulder and in these movies or on tv dislocated shoulders are usually treated in two ways one there is a fearless action hero who is obviously so this is a video on uh, shoulder bones, the scapula and the humerus. It will talk about that and it will talk about the joint itself. And one thing about these videos is that, for example, you can increase the speed. So, for example, you're watching a speed one, you know, you know everything and you just want to look at it as a quicker version just to make sure you have all the labels and everything. You can watch it as two speed. Also, it gives you the captions, you know, so you can like write down your notes if you're saying something, you know, so, so these videos are amazing and they make it really just interesting, like story like and easy. And this is best for oral exams. And this is the customized quiz. Like see, there's basic identification, advanced identification, muscle facts, etc. And you have the question back in the basic identification is what I start off with in the beginning because it's just much easier. Um, let's say you can go here. When I do it in Latin because we're taught in Latin. For example, here, which image shows a humor? So which one would it be? It's this one. I just click it. Caput humeri. The caput humeri is the head of the humeri. So I just click the head of the humeri. Column anatomical. So the same way, they're going to keep on giving you questions and keep on picking the right answer. And in this quiz, they will highlight the ones that you don't know the names of the structures that you don't know and they'll keep on giving it to you until you get those structures right i hope i gave you a clear view on what's like to use canop because canop is absolutely amazing it's a must-have um you know resource for anatomy like it will make your life so much easier i can't even say like you know forget about reading those boring textbooks you know forget about you know searching have everything here you know why make your life calm and now all for the news that you've all been waiting for is now here canhub is giving 10 percent off on all their packages for maybe one month or three months or a lifetime so you can get 10 percent off on the package um the link is below and you can use that to get your 10 percent off also canhub is giving six giveaway one month free premium access to the canhub so if you want to try it out and you're not sure whether it's worth it, use this chance to get your giveaway and, you know, try out Kenna for a month and I promise you won't regret it. So that was it for today. See you guys.